I'm reviewing a HRR 216 K9 VKA Honda self-propelled lawnmower. I haven't accepted any money to do this review. It's an independent one. It's a three-in-one system. You can set the clip director to the bag setting. The door at the rear of the mower is in the open position, so the clippings will go into the bag. To remove the bag, lift the discharge guard and simply lift the bag up. When the bag is removed and the door is open, the clippings will discharge at the back of the mower. When the clip director is moved to the mulch position, the door closes. The wheels are not ball bearing. The height adjustment is from one and one eighth inches to four inches. There's an air filter that will need to be replaced and that's very easy to access and remove and replace or clean. The handle adjusts to two positions and it also folds forward for storage or travel. You just turn these two plastic knobs on either side this way. Then the handle just pushes forward. There's twin blades. It's belt drive, so you'll be replacing a belt. Here's the other end of the belt, and that'll be turning the rear wheels. There's another look at the blade and the belt. During my research before purchasing this mower, I found there were three common complaints. One of them is that all four wheels didn't make contact on the ground on a flat surface. I'll give people the benefit of the doubt that they have all four wheels in the same position. Perhaps during shipping, this bracket gets bent or somehow repositioned. There's complaints that your thumbs get tired from pushing on the smart drive. Uh, that's what controls the speed of the mower. My control came from the factory in this position and I think people don't realize that you can adjust it. Push this button over and you can position it higher. If it's positioned higher then you can grasp and hold it with the palms of your hands. And last, there's some complaints about the automatic choke starting to stick after some time. There's two springs, and this is the choke action. I'm thinking it's probably important to make sure that those springs don't break or get gunked up with a lot of debris. The owner's manual also spends a lot of time on how to store the mower with gas. I'm thinking that if you don't follow those procedures that after some time the carburetor starts to get gunked up and, and stuck. As I was finishing up the video, a friend stopped by. He has the same engine and for the past 10 years he's never had any problems and it starts first pull every time fuel switch on okay this will be the first pull let's see if it starts it's hard to show cutting results the grass is being cut fully and cleanly the mower had plenty of power to cut through some rather long and thick clumps of grass i tried all three cutting options they all work great. The fastest speed is a very brisk walk. After cutting my lawn for the first time, I'm not disappointed with the results. Time will tell if this is a durable product. 
I hope you found this video helpful. A thumbs up is always appreciated. Click on the channel name Know How Now to find other videos. And thanks for watching.